Hey there, Lou with Bergen Pickers here, and today we have the Buddy L Stables. I'm gonna call this a wagon, van, transporter for horses. Uh, so here, let's take a peek. It's uh, the cab is burgundy. Got the nice Buddy L decal there. Uh, the front windshield intact. A couple of scuffs, but completely intact. So this, uh, I'm going to call it a, some kind of window or dome window for the uh, box. And this is usually cracked or missing. Uh, this one is present. So we have one of the side doors here for the horses to get in. And there's, you can see there's another door on the other side, but this is the only functional one. So the other one was never intended to be opened. And I'm going to close that so we can see. There we go, that's what that looks like. Boom, closed. Uh, let's keep going around here. Oh, yeah, there they are, the horses that are being transported. Uh, so generally, so I guess it came with a, actually two adult horses, two fully grown horses, and a foal, foal baby. Um, these are in excellent condition. Uh, no signs of, I mean, no denting, no melting, which is what usually happens with them. Again, this set was played with as were 99.9% .9 of all these toys, so you will find little marks and scuffs on them, that's normal. And to be expected from a toy that's, you know, 50 years old or so. Um, these are cool, the little windows, the they slide open, so they're made of plastic, and I don't have long nails, so you don't have to get in there. Let me try it from the inside. Boop. Hello there, how are you? Oh, never mind. There we go. That opens. It's got one on the opposite side, and that one opens as well. Again, doing this with one hand, a little difficult, so I'll use my nail there. Boom, done. All right, so I'm going to move these horses to the side. For a second, will you admire that horse on the wagon? Boom. Okay. So you see the ramp here? Doing. So this ramp has got a little. Um, it says to open turn. It's a little lever to open it. It's got the Buddy L stables uh, with the caution horses uh, wording on there. Okay. Again, difficult to open. So I'm gonna see if I can frame it for you. Can't. So what I do is I like tilting it down, boom, and it opens right back up. So there's the ramp. So when you turn, what happens uh, when you turn that knob, that knob right there, and when the door, when the ramp is closed, that's a little metal uh, piece there, and on the other side as well, that will uh, lock into these holes on the door, so that the ramp won't. Um, open. Okay, so you got some dividers here. So you got the two horses here, the two adult horses where you're supposed to place in here. And then uh, on the side door, that's where you put, put I guess, the, the, the foal. These are removable. This one actually folds down. So let me correct myself. This one folds down to become part of the ramp. Okay. This divider is removable. So if you lift this up here, and pull it from the two tabs in the back. There you go. Removable. Great condition. One of my favorite features, as I put you down again. Pop this right back in here. Done. And that locks into place. I want to make sure it's done on both sides. Done. Okay. Boom, back locked into place. Close it. Do -do -do. I'm just gonna flip this guy over. There we go. Again, as you can see, nice colors. Minor, minor scuffing, but 99% of the paint is there with only a couple of flea bites or marks. Super nice. Another logo. 
this window is functional as well. Again, I can't get my nail on there, so I'm going to open it, push it. At this point, I'm sure there's one or two of you guys saying, oh, boring, you already did it on the other side. Well, I want to show that it's fully functional, and that's how it's supposed to work. Okay, so one of the coolest features, and I know this is probably just a guy thing, um, is the suspension on it. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Sweet. All the wheels run perfectly. And, yep, that works. Top condition, good. Again, minor scuffing, otherwise, very nice. Let's the bottom, real quick. All right, here we go. Nice, clean paint. And there's the metal wiring that allows for the suspension to move up and down. The tires are nice. Chrome still there. Some white walls. Inside here reads, uh, looks like patent info. Buddy L USA. Made in the good old USA, folks. Good stuff made in the United States. Good toys, great toys, mid-century toys were made in the USA. Now don't get me wrong, not bashing the Japanese and the Chinese. Well, I'm, okay, maybe the Chinese a little bit because of the modern CRAP that gets uh, made, but the good stuff came from Japan as far as tin goes and like those robot toys. But when it comes to US made stuff, um, especially vintage toys, that's, you know, the, in my opinion, it's got a lot of appeal. It's what most collectors would want, especially in great condition. So that's the most important part. It has to be in great condition. Most of these were played with. Um, the horses are usually missing or in bad condition. Something got melted off, a tail got broken off, and the ear is gone, chewed out by the dog, leg is missing, deep scratches, dents, holes, whatnot. Um, but when you got something nice like this, with the paint, uh, all nice, all the windows intact, nothing broken or missing. Um, then this is a collectible ready for display. So this is Lou with Bergen Pickers. Um, please subscribe to us if you want to see more videos like this. Um, also follow us on Twitter at Bergen Pickers. Uh, leave comments below. I'll answer any questions pretty quickly. Um, or if you have any questions, uh, let's say you have one and you're looking to sell it or anything like that, you can always contact us and visit our website at BergenPickers.com. Always looking to buy. All right. So this has been the Buddy L Stables. I call it a wagon, you, or some kind of horse transporter. Um, and I'm guessing this was made in the mid-60s. All right. See you later.